A pipe cleaner elf looks great sitting on your shelf or in your tree as a Christmas ornament. It's easy to make, let me show you how. For this project, you'll need two tan, one white, and three green pipe cleaners, fingernail clippers, googly eyes, and craft glue. We're going to start by making the body of the elf. So find the halfway point and make a head about an inch long and just twist the neck around once or twice to hold it in place. Then the tails are going to become the legs. So at the very end, twist up the end into a little round foot and bend it up forward and do the same thing for the other side. Bend it up so she can stand up. Clip the other tan pipe cleaner in half and one half is going to become the arms and hold it. Hold it slightly off center and wrap it around once to hold the arms in place. The ends will turn up to make her hands. And there we've got our basic body. We'll start making the dress of the elf by taking the end of a green pipe cleaner and just securing it at the neck. And what we're going to do to make uh, the bodice is to bring it down over one shoulder and up under the other arm, across under the other arm, around the shoulder, and back down again. And that'll give us a nice little top. Now start coiling the pipe cleaner around the body, one coil right next to the other, as close as you can get them. When you have about a fourth of the pipe cleaner left, just coil it one around the other, right around where the waist should be. Separate out the legs just a little bit. And with the other green pipe cleaner, start where you left off, about the waist, and continue down, and you're going to be making a skirt. This is a little tricky because you don't want to coil too tight. You want to keep it loose. Um, so you want to just kind of hold it in place and bend those ends, but don't pull it too tight. And make it a little bigger as you go down. Now you're going to want to, at the end of that pipe cleaner, or just tuck it in to itself so everything will stay put. Now we're going to make the ears and the nose for our elf. So at one end of the other half of the tan pipe cleaner, fold just a tiny little triangle and make it as pointy as you can. That's going to be a pointy elf ear. Hold it to the side of the head a little more than halfway down. Now when you come across in the middle there, we're going to make a tiny little triangle again to make the nose. And then on the other side, we're going to bend up another ear. So it's not attached yet, but you want to hold that in place and then start coiling the rest of that pipe cleaner down toward the neck and it should all stay in place. Now it's going to look really weird right now, but I promise It'll look better shortly. Okay, now we're going to make the hat. And to do this, you're going to use the next green pipe cleaner. And I'm going to tuck it down behind the ears. And then start wrapping it around. About two or three coils right on top of each other like that. And when you get to this point, what I find um, is an easy thing to do is maybe take a pen or a pencil and hold it against the edge there and coil it around like this. It makes your job a little bit easier. Remove the pen and then you can adjust the coils to make a pointy top on the hat. Super cute. This one, I was going to make it a girl 
elf if you want to make um, an elf with a beard you can cut a white pipe cleaner in half and then um, find the middle by folding it in half and give it a sharp point bend each side in and out once leaving a tiny little tail at the end which you're going to bend back I'm going to bend it in once and back out, leaving the little tail. Okay, fold it all together. It's going to look like this. And then these two little ends are going to go in right on both sides of the nose to hold the beard in place. Now, with the rest of that white pipe cleaner, you can add some trim to the top of the hat or the bottom of the dress if you would like. So I think I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna cut this in half. And I'm just gonna wrap it around the base of the hat. And then I think I'm gonna wrap this one um, right around the middle of the dress just to add a little interest. The very last step is to glue some eyes on our elf. So just use a blob of thick white craft glue and set the eyes in place. And you're finished. Please subscribe to my channel for more pipe cleaner crafts and other ideas. There's new videos every week, so you don't want to miss an episode.